Good morning, guys. Welcome to Cassie Tara. We're going to start out with a prayer to St. Michael the Archangel in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. I'm going to shuffle some cards. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in our day of battle, protect us against the deceit and wickedness of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, banish into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who run through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. And our guardian angel, O angel of God, my guardian dear, to him God's love commits me here. Ever this day, be at my side to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. Ahmed Jama. Happy winter solstice. This is a high holy day for me, right? And then Christmas is at the end of the week, so I call this Holy Week. So God bless you guys with love and peace, right? Amen. Praise be to God in the highest, right? Go outside, hug a tree, smoke a tree, praise the Lord. Look at the sky, look at the clouds. Thank God for the earth, the water, the moon, the stars, the sun all the planets, and just be happy, right? Love yourself, love your families, respect, have integrity. Go forth and create good things, right? Amen. So, let's start off with the tarot, right? So, the first card we have is death. Amen. Death and rebirth. This is the, the new dawn of a new day. Everybody realize that you have a chance always to create and start over again, right? So this is a new beginning. Amen. Perfect card today. Uh, then I saw the three of wands. Like somebody's waiting for something. Wait with God, right? Amen. And we have the king of cups. This person is coming in loving you mind, body, and soul. Amen. This guy is awesome, right? The water signs. Oh, shit. Then we have the emperor on the bottom. He wants to grow with you, right? He wants to create and grow with you. Father, in the name of Jesus, may I please have one more card? Amen for the collective and love this morning. I saw the ten of wands putting down your burdens, right? Yes. That tried to come out again. So somebody is getting over some shit. So we have the devil, El Diablo, right? Le Demon. So this is um uh uh like um breaking free free of any toxic influences, right? This is liberty over oppression, depression, any of that shit, right? If you got any toxic people around you, cut them the fuck out. Then we have the sun. This is the happiest card in the whole deck, right? You God, Holy Spirit, universe, source. Blessing Mother Mary, everybody is coming towards you and blessing you with this happy, happy, love-filled card, right? The Hermit, going into a cave and getting the knowledge of the mystical three, right? The energies in this card is awesome, right? The Nine of Pentacles, this is the um, pre-empress. This lady has everything. She's beautiful, loving, caring. She's psychic. She takes care of home, family, work, all of that. She's just missing love, right? The hanged woman. This is skirt. You are now getting enlightenment from the most high. It's a pause, right? You need the time to um, redirect, right? The two of cups. You and your higher self, your true love. This person is coming in. Amen. The empress, right? Growth. Create. Amen. This is awesome, right? Let me look at your cards. You have one, two, three, four... Five, six major arcana out of nine cards. So this is awesome, guys. Now let me just ask for some clarifiers. You got the Princess of Cups and the King of Swords. This person is coming in, right? The King of Swords is Libra, Aquarius, and Gemini, but he is in love with you. He's wanting to tell you that, right? And so this is awesome, right? The Hierophant, this guy right here has high standards, and you are breaking generational curses, right? Accept this love that's going to come in, right? The chariot, as above, so below, right? The world, the end of a cycle, right? This is turning a chapter, a new day has become. The moon, right? Revelations, truth, secrets, all this shit is coming out. The nine of cups, right? This person loves you so much. This is like awesome. This is your wish card. This is what's coming in for you. This princess of wands is the inspiration, right? This person is coming in because this balance, right? 
So, amen. This is awesome. Father, in the name of Jesus, let me get some clarifiers. Who is the King of Swords, Father? Who is the King of Swords? In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. I saw the Queen of Cups, right? And the Five of Wands. So, this person is fighting to come forward and tell you that they're in love with you, right? Amen. Who is the King of Swords, Father, in the name of Jesus? We have the Magician... This person has created this love. They were probably all over your energy. You may have felt them. You probably know who it is, but they're in love. And they're loving you, mind, body, and soul. Everything this lady touches turns to gold. So this is a generous person. This person is psychic. This is a love that is coming that you really are going to enjoy. And strength. You have the ability, the creativity in you to create, master, and do everything. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, who is the Son? Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, who is the Son? The Ten of Pentacles, right? Amen. The Wheel of Fortune. This is the end of delays, forward progression, movement, right? This is um, karma and fate coming your way because of all the good stuff you put in. The Ten of Pentacles is coming to you. This is generational wealth. This is legacy wealth. All this shit is coming. And it's the King of Pentacles. Amen. And you have manifest, this guy is a, um, he's the ultimate partner, right? Amen. We got a divine pair. We got the king and queen of pentacles. This is divine feminine, divine masculine. And God brought this together. Amen. With the hierophant here. Amen. So we know that's who you guys have coming in for you on this high holy day. So we're going to ask for um, two cards from our island oracle tarot. Amen. Akhmadamajama, you guys have a very good day. Akhmadamajama, Father, please give us two cards. And we have two. Healing heart and not enough. So look, we're going to transmute this not enough, right? Because it says, um, frustrated in a relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, and fear, ego issues, and jealousy. I'm going to be honest with you. This goes with this devil card. And I do believe with God here, this person is walking away from this toxic relationship and they're coming to you. And this is healing heart, healing from heartbreak. That's me. I've healed. So God is bringing in my king of pentacles, right? Freedom from toxic relationships or addiction, right? I see blossom. This is the sun. Latch on to the sun, right? The father, the most high God, spirit, universe, the ethers. Everybody is here for you. Latch on to the sun, this fire, and go forth, right? With happiness, creation. Amen. We're going to create everything. Manifest. Father, please give me a card from these. Oh, shit. We got two cards pretty quickly. We got rebuild. Amen. Awesome. So you're going to come forth and rebuild with this dedicated effort. See this angel? God is here for you guys. All right. Let me get one card from the, if you have a question, ask your question. And we're going to see what we come up with, right? Akhmadama Jama. Father, in the name of Jesus, please help my, oh shit, a year from now. So some of you guys may be married a year from now, and that's awesome. So God bless you guys. Ciao. Happy winter solstice.